This place was built, I think, around about 1954, 53. You think that every vice president of design has worked here to, in some, some capacity. Uh, and all the cars that have been here, and you know, if this, this place could tell stories, it would be, there'd, there'd be a few stories to tell. This is the place where designs have been chosen, where we showed in themes, where we actually work. We actually use it as a working building as well, in terms of we, we, we bring the clays in here, we use it to stand back and look at, we put tapes in the clays and we modify it. So it's had a lot of use over the years, and it's uh, sad to see the place go. Obviously, anything that's on the roads in the US from Ford came through this building really since 1955 through to the present day. I think it was a place of pride as well that, uh, that, uh, that we had this standalone secret place as well. The courtyard that's out the back was there then as well. And uh, I, I think there was a real sense of camaraderie as there is today in terms of this, is, this was our place and this is design. And I remember actually a story about the curtains here and we actually, uh, you can see these curtains which are full width and really big. We actually sent them out to get dry cleaned, I think in the early 2000s. And for some reason they came back pink. And uh, we had pink curtains for quite a few years, and no one, could under, no, no one who didn't know the story would understand why we had pink curtains. Adjacent to the showroom is, is, a, is a corridor which we call Mahogany Road, and it's a beautiful curved, row, cor curved corridor, which was very sort of trendy back in the 60s, so you, so you couldn't see the end of it. Uh, it is panelled with mahogany, and it was the, the place where all the design executives were, the design directors, design chiefs were there. Colour materials used to be up, upstairs. When product development moved into the PDC as well, we, the, the mahogany row became sort of the place for all the, the VPs and uh, directors for, for um, product development. Interestingly enough, William Clay Ford had an office there up to a few years ago because he at one time was in charge of design, so he was, he was, a, he was in charge of styling at Ford uh, in the 50s, I believe. Obviously, the, the prior vice presidents have all worked in this building. You know, um, when I came here, Jack Telnick was, was the vice president, and, uh, and then, of course, of course Jay Mays, but also the, the three prior to that were also involved in the building itself. Uh, and also, we've had, we've had other, other people have shown here, for example, you know, Jerry McGovern from Land Rover would, would bring his Land Rovers here when, when Ford was involved with Land Rover. Jeff Lawson from Jaguar would have been here to show Jaguar products. So it's not just Ford products that were shown here, it's actually some, some really important people and some really important products in the past history. When the showroom in Studio West was built, we built a courtyard also uh, adjacent to, to the studio. And the courtyard is, uh, is like the showroom, it's a great space for us to stand back and look at cars. And it, it's, it's, it's immense and you can put you know, maybe 10 competitor cars in there as well, which is really good. So it's just, again, it's just really useful for the designers to to be able to assess the vehicle, look at the volumes, look at the proportions. It has a turntable in the centre as well, so we can rotate the car too. So it's a, so it's really useful, and it's really like in obviously in the in the, the summer weather we use that a lot more than we'd use it in the winter. We've had some fun events in the courtyard as well. At one time, one of our designers, uh, without someone's permission, actually brought a Mustang in and drifted around the courtyard. We also use the courtyard for an annual um, car show event, and the designers bring their cars in. We have food trucks. We have special events here. When we have our um, Bring Your Kids to Work Day, we use the showroom and so they can come in here, they can practice clay modeling, they can, they can see people drawing, so we use that. So it's a, it's, there's some nice social events we've had here too.